Hey guys, Heidi Easley here, Texas Art and Soul, and I teach women how to make money teaching paint parties in person, online, and through art kits. Now, as you come on, I want you to just say hi, tell me where you're from, and then I'm going to see if I can see the comments, because here's the thing. We have opened the doors to Paint Party Headquarters, and I'm going to show you what to put in this art kit. We have had so many questions over the past two days on what do we need to put in an art kit. So please let me know in the comments if you want to know what is needed in an art kit so that you can start selling those right now. Also, we have been talking a lot about this book, Big Magic. If you have not read it yet, please read it, okay? It will set you free. It's like, I'm not trying to compare it to the Bible because obviously the Bible is number one, but it's, it's this awesome, glorious book on how to not let fear take over you. Because again, the conversation has been online paint parties, art kits, and pretty much fear and people struggling with confidence. So let me know if that is you, if you've been struggling with confidence or fear, if that's you, please, please, please download the audio of this read it please it will just help you so much you won't really care what people are saying oh good we have a lot of people linda wants to know what's in the art kit and um, who else wants to know deborah i think wants to know iris awesome um, and we teach so much of this in paint party headquarters um so we have opened the doors i'm going to go ahead and put the link in let me see if i can pin that to the top i don't know if it'll let me um no, I don't think it'll let me. Let me see. Maybe. Um, so I went ahead and put the link in so that you can join Paint Party Headquarters. Because if you join, we close the doors on Thursday at midnight and it's only $35. And then you're going to be able to get so much goodness. And in a minute, I'll show you some of these art kits that you can automatically start using. So this, the things you need to know first, do a heart or a like if you were wanting to know what to put in an art kit. And I also want to share with you, we have people that are selling anywhere from two to five to 1600 art kits in our paint party headquarters and um, group. So there are all kinds of stages where people are selling all different ones. And um, Denise says fear, false evidence appearing real. Oh my gosh. So true. Don't let fear stop you. Um, do we mail the kits or curbside pickup? Um, so I have done this a couple of different ways. I recommend doing like going to Starbucks, saying you're going to be there from 11 to 1. You can play on your phone, drink your coffee, and everybody can pick up there. So it can be like a local pickup. And um, if you're a person who doesn't mind porch pickup, but I have done delivery and I'm actually doing delivery on Friday. So I'm delivering 30 kits to a country club where I used to do paint parties, which will continue to do paint parties once um, we're allowed to in person. But for right now, we're doing kits. So a couple of things that you want to add to your kit. We have people and a lot of people are probably helping answer these questions, too. But I want to share really quick. And um, this is just a sticker. You don't have to have a sticker. And um, the ladies in paint party headquarters, I got to just give them a round of applause. <laughs> because what they have done is, I mean, they've taken lunch bags and just drawn with Sharpies to make them look cute. They've done all different kinds of things. Because how many of you out there are, um, you have so much art supplies that you, like, if you're a crafter or an artist, it's almost like we're hoarders in a way. Like, we keep so much supplies. So a lot of times, we don't even have to go order supplies. But if we do, um, I'm going to show you a couple of things to put in there. So I put a dollar store paper plate. I put a paper towel, just one little fold of a paper towel. Oh, there's a second fold. I'll go ahead and put that in there since we're doing that. Okay, paper towel. And you can get these at the dollar store, just a little cup for them to rinse their brushes with. Um, whatever you're going to do. So the ones that I'm delivering on um, Friday are the butterflies. So I'm doing 16 by 20s. It's going to be $30 a piece, and it's the um, it'll already be pre-traced. They'll have everything ready to go um, in there. So obviously a 16 by 20 canvas isn't going to fit in this bag. So I would just put that by their door along with this, right? Or if they're coming to pick it up, here's your canvas. Here's your bag. Have a great day. Then um, let's say it's a smaller one. So this is just a cute little llama on a piece of wood. 
So if you're in a place where there's no um, <laughs> hashtag buy nothing project, Denise, I love you. That's so true. Uh, if you're in a place where um, you don't have canvases, get creative. Draw it on wood. We do um, a black white llama with this one. Very cool. Okay. And then use these little cups. So I get these little Amazon cups, one ounce, nothing major. And I just fill them with paint, shut them. Throw them in there. And then brushes. Usually what I like to do is I like to, let's see, I like to take um, a little brush. So this is this is just a brush you can get at Michael's or Hobby Lobby. Um, one brush like this or a foam brush. Again, whatever you have is fine. So one bigger brush. And then this little kit I found at Hobby Lobby, they had them 50% off. So for $8, well, $8.50, I got 30 pack classroom set. Isn't that amazing? So I'm just going to grab it and I'm going to grab one of them and then I'm going to put it in there. So for kids kits, I'll sell these for 10 to $15. Okay. Kids kits, you know, the brushes, it'll be like one foam brush and one of those brushes, the adult kits that I'm selling for $30. Those are, I'm sorry, $25. Those are going to be $25 each, and they're going to have the butterfly, a 16 by 20 canvas, and all the colors they need, plus the instructions. So another little fun thing that you can add to your kit, where did I put it? Hold on. Here it is. Is a fun note, okay? So note cards. A thank you. A lot of these are your repeat customers, right? So if this is your repeat customer, you of course want to add a thank you card. And Pixie, she actually has been helping me pack my art kits. So she's been writing notes. Thank you for supporting my mom's business. And then she signs it Pixie. And then we put the note in there as well. And um, some of my members are putting little um, cups of glitter, not the shake glitter. Don't do that to your customers. Not nice but the, the glitter glue. So you could put that as like a little surprise into your kit as well. So that's just a few things that that was more than five things to add to your art kit. But the reason I wanted to share this with you is because our members in Paint Party Headquarters are having so much success with this. And I'm going to share my screen really quick because let's see. Let me make sure you can still hear me. I'm going to share my screen really quick because I want to show you um, entire screen. Okay. I want to show you. So in Paint Party Headquarters, you have immediate, like as soon as you sign up, which we close the doors at midnight on Thursday. So make sure, and you're going to be grandfathered in at $35 a month. So you have immediate rights to use any of these designs for your art kit. So for example, this flamingo that's been really, really popular right now. So right here, we have a tracer. You can immediately print that carbon copy paper and use that on your art kits and have it ready to go. Okay. And I've been teaching this one. I taught this one yesterday on a Facebook live. So you'll know exactly how to do it. What colors, all of that. And um, the butterfly, that one's really popular right now. I'm doing the kits for um, a country club that I used to go to. This one's really popular. I mean, there's so many things that you can grab and immediately do. And this is just a part of it. We have Christmas designs, Halloween designs. We're always adding. And then another thing that is really, really cool, tons of kids designs. Another thing that's really cool when you are in Paint Party Headquarters is, you know, we have almost a thousand people now in Paint Party Headquarters. Now, here's what I love so much about it is the art kits. So we had Gina and Lori, two of our members. Um, one's a, a graphic designer. One is um, really artsy. They're all artsy, right? We're in a, a crafty place. And here they put these together. So I had provided all of these free drawings for them to use as art kits. Then they took it a step further. So you don't have to go try to whip out a bunch of stuff. You can literally grab and go save image as, and then start selling your art kits right away. So I'm a big person about like, don't do, don't go set up 30 art kits and then try to, um, 
Let me see if it'll let me stop sharing. There we go. I'm a person who's like, don't go set up, you know, 30 art kits and then hope you sell them. Sell them using our marketing materials, then get them ready. So for example, I've already sold those 30 art kits at $25 a piece and at 16 by 20 canvases. We're just now getting them ready. Pixie's helping me get them ready today and tomorrow so that we can deliver them Friday. We did not get 30 art kits ready first, okay? So I just am so excited to help y'all with this. This has been a huge, huge question lately. And remember, art kits is just one part of it. Marketing is 80 to 90% of that. And that is where I really, really love to help you in Paint Party Headquarters. Um, I love so much to help you get new marketing techniques, new social media strategies, as well as giving you everything you need to do so you can start making money right away. And not only with art kits, but online paint parties. So our women, oh my gosh, so, so happy. Um, art kits for kids anywhere from 10 to 15. Um, the, the ladies in paint party headquarters have really stretched themselves. So we have all you know, had this pivot, right? And so our in-person parties have gone from totally, you know, you know, going, 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 and then they're being postponed and canceled. And so now our paint party headquarter ladies are learning how to do Facebook lives, how to sell art kits, how to do online virtual paint parties. And we are having so many people stepping out of their comfort zone and having success. So we want you to join us, but we close the doors Thursday at midnight. And um, we're not going to open them to the public again until September. When we open them in September, the price will go up. So you will be grandfathered in at $35 a month. So when you think about the risk, okay, $35 a month, I could cancel at any time, but I could potentially sell how many art kits or do a virtual paint party versus maybe let me just do it myself. Like you literally have everything at your fingertips. You can, you can grab and go. So I'm excited to share this with you again. We have been working so, so hard to make this helpful and successful for you. So it makes it really easy. And um, we have tons of people that are, um, yeah, that are asking questions and that are saying, you know, how much this, this is a no brainer. And um, Janice says, Heidi has thought of everything. It makes it a no brainer for me to sign up. I'm taking my business to the next level. Yeah, marketing. Yes, please. Again, if you're struggling with fear, download this ASAP. You will get over that quick. And um, I've shared this before and I'll share it again. Um, this is my co-creating um, journal with God about my business. So again, I put God first in my business and I truly believe that's why he keeps making it succeed is because I'm asking him to help me with it. And, and my prayers and my dreams are all written in these pages. And I don't share this with anybody. And um, this is just letters to God about what can I do? How can we create? What can we make together? All of these really cool things. So I recommend journaling, you know, asking for things. And um, in the Bible, it says ask. And, you know, God wants us to have wisdom to make money. But what I have found with um, creatives and crafters and painters you know, we're a sensitive bunch. You know, I am a sensitive soul and we make these awesome things, but then we feel bad charging for them. Guys, I want you to know that there is nothing wrong with charging for what you have done. You would never walk into a yoga studio and not pay your yoga instructor. I'm not a yoga person, so I'm just saying that as an example, <laughs> okay? You would never walk into a dentist and not pay the dentist. You would never do any of that. So why? Why would we create this awesome thing? You know, what God has given us, these talents, but then we just devalue it and say, no, I shouldn't charge for it. How dare I charge for it? Because it was fun. Okay. We are all made different and uniquely. God made us all different. God gave us all different talents. And it is so, so important that you know that it is okay but here's the thing. Most creatives, they won't get serious about the marketing. They won't get serious about it. They won't learn about it because they just want to paint. And I get that. In a perfect world, I would just be watching my Hallmark movies, painting and listening to my music, and everything would be fine. And there would be food on my table and I'd have a roof over my head. 
But no, this is how I make money is through paint parties, through teaching online paint parties, all of those things through art kits that I'm delivering on Friday, just like y'all. And so it is OK to do that. But what I've noticed is that some people really succeed at art kits and online paint parties and paint parties in person. And some people struggle because they're struggling with the marketing. Now, when you join Paint Party Headquarters, you're going to have access to tons of designs that you can easily grab. I mean, we even have like step by step instructions so you could print them off, put them in your art kit if you wanted to. But here's what I want you to know. As you are learning marketing, you have to give yourself grace. It's just like any skill, any skill you have ever done. You have to give yourself grace. You have to practice it to get better. You can't do your first Facebook Live and have two viewers and go, well, that was a flop. Never doing that again. No, my Facebook Lives used to always have just my mom, <laughs> me and my mom on Facebook Live every time. You know, you have to build it. But there's so many tips and things that I can help you that I have learned and shortcuts and just the two Facebook ad trainings alone is worth the money. If you take anything from it, just those two Facebook ad trainings alone are worth gold in there. So I'm just excited for you. Um, Heidi, another Heidi in here says, my business has grown leap and bounds, leaps and bounds since I joined Paint Party Headquarters. This membership has been a blessing to me. Thank you so much for saying that. Um, yeah, Sh Sheila says, I think you're a brand new member, right? Sheila, she said, super excited to up my Paint Party game. Looking forward to learning marketing big time. Definitely, you've got to you've got to take that part serious. And I know in a perfect world, we just really want to paint, right? We do. But guys, the people out there that are really able to make really good money for their family, there's nothing wrong with making money for your family. I used to give everything away for free. Everything. Oh, you like that painting? Here you go. I spent 14 hours on it, but okay. Right? Like we don't value it. You need to value it. Um, and I'm going to teach you so much of that. Amanda says, been a sister. We call Paint Party Headquarters sisters. And um, since November, literally the best decision of my business. Heidi has changed my life. Oh, thank you for saying that, Amanda. Um, yeah, so there's so many different things. Um, let's see. Is this something you would suggest if somebody already has a direct sales business? Julie, um, we are highly focused on paint parties. In-person paint parties, paint parties online, and art kits. However, there is a ton of marketing and social media that you can use for any business. But I am not going to sit here and say the conversation is very wide to all businesses because I specifically help people who are creative, who are doing online paint parties, who are doing paint parties in person, who are doing some kind of creative business. But you will get a lot from it just from the marketing standpoint. And I've had people who've joined that have been doing paint party stuff and then they have their husband who's doing another business and they use some of those strategies for that. And it has helped. And um, Dee says, I've been here a year this month. It's worth it. I was excited when my business started coming back shortly after I started. And Sarah, oh, awesome. She just joined. Excited about this total God thing. And I am so excited for y'all. Again, you know, I just wanted to share with you a few of the things that you can put in your art kits. People are so creative you know once you get into paint party headquarters once you join you are going to see so much stuff with art kits like i have a post and it's hundreds of comments of members i mean we're at almost a thousand members so you can imagine hundreds of comments of members saying like here's what's working for my art kit here's what i did for my art kit here's how i did this like we're all helping each other and jumping in and um, let's see, Donna says, hi, Heidi, new member here. Welcome, Donna. And um, spent the afternoon in PPHQ learning marketing hacks. Super informative. So awesome. And um, let's see, um, Denise. Yes, she will uplift you. Diane says, what do you get when you first start in your kit? So um, you are you are actually creating your own kit. So what I'm teaching you is how to make your own to sell them so you can sell them to your local area. Some people ship, but I just choose to sell them to my local customers that I've already been doing paint parties with. And um, yes, art right, kit, show them again. Yeah, I'm going to end this so y'all can rewind it and see everything that's in this. 
Um, okay, yeah, so you can watch the first part. Yeah, Dan and Danny, you'll be able to review it. So anybody who's just getting here, I want you to go back, watch the whole thing. Um, it's very short. I'm about to end it, so it is short. And then I want you to watch it and see what you can put in your art kit, but also see all of the great, great tutorials you're going to immediately get and be able to use to make money in your paint party business. So I'm excited for you. Um, I went ahead and put the link here so you can go ahead and join. Again, we have until Thursday at midnight, the doors close and that is it. We will raise the prices in September. So get grandfathered in because I have recently, since all of this has happened, I have recently added all of my, everything that I create, you can use in online parties, in person parties, and with art kits. So you have a ton of resources. So I'm excited to help you on this paint party adventure. And I'm gonna end this so you can go back and you can watch and see what I put in them. All right, I'll talk to y'all soon. Bye guys.